evening. I'm... Reese's bitch. Celia, relax. He knows I'm kidding. Right, Slim? Oh, sweetie, you look so beautiful. I'm not wearing the shoes, but they go. Listen to yourself. Well, I happen to, to think that heels are an outmoded display of female oppression. Fine. Thanks, Mom. Wait, you're... Griffin. Right. How are you? Great. Normal. Actually, I, uh... Whoa, too thirsty, bro. <laughs> He's great, Phoebe. <laughs> you know, we were uh, actually just catching up. You know, Griffin here, he definitely wants to be uh, interviewed. Oh, really? Yeah. Mm -mm. No, I don't remember saying that. No, that would be great. Have a different perspective. You went away for high school, right? Yes, he did. I did. Oh, we'll reach out when you're free. It's uh, Phoebe. Fisher. Right. Thanks. So, I mean, what are you gonna do to celebrate this acceptance? And there are a few things that I'd like to do. Well, inform me. What? Uh, one, I really wanna do this. And two, I wanna do that again. A few months ago, I was a guy who carried around this empty feeling. And I thought that it could be filled by driving the nicest car, dating the most popular girl, or going to the fanciest school. Through it all, there were these little pockets of air when I felt like I was truly myself. And that was when I was with you. No, I just, I worry if I've never been able to fully let my guard down with someone, maybe I'm not capable. Look, Phoebe, I'm gonna be real honest with you. I would like to be that person. And I love that you are a way too wise for your years artist. And that you look like an angel, a sex goddess, and a nerdy librarian all in the same moment. <laughs> Not that you look like a librarian or a nerd. I love nerds. Not in a weird way, but... <laughs> Reese let you use his car. Man, he was really desperate to get out of this, wasn't he? No, 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 he wanted to go with you. He just thought we would have more fun together. Uh-huh. There you are. Aw, that's cute. But I can open my own doors. Thanks. I'm never girl. It's kind of hard for me to explain her personality in everything. You think you're so much better than me, Celia. Better than everyone here, but I know the truth. You're nothing but a hypocrite. A fake. Um, hold on a second. So you stomp around in those boots and you act so tough, but that's all it is. It's just an act. Brooks, please don't do this. A defense mechanism. See, it's a poor attempt 
at pushing people away. You're afraid that if somebody were to get too close to you, they might actually find out the truth. That's Celia Lieberman? She's boring. You want to push me away? Go ahead, because we're through, baby. We are done. We are. How's that for a defense mechanism? The guy from the gym. I tried to tell you. What are you talking about? Your dad? You knew? Oh my God, Phoebe, I'm sorry. I'm gonna be sick or I'm gonna punch something. I don't know which. Wait, so when you saw him with the woman and then you met my mom, you... So you've known... How, how long ago was that? Like a week? Five days. So the whole of the 4th of July together, you were lying. I wanted to tell you. I tried to tell you. I... No, I should thank you, Griffin, because I almost started to let my guard down for the first time in my life, but luckily you just ruined the last shred of faith in humanity I had left. Wait, Phoebe, stop. Look, I get you're mad, but this is his shit. I didn't do this. You knew that my mom thought this was real, and you just went along and you did nothing. I didn't know what to do. <laughs> it's a little. It's a little. It's funny if you think it's funny too. But only. If you, it's funny.